Sparkles here. Okay, we got us a real rant going on on insurance loopholes, and this is really number two rant. Um, I already put my question in for the debate, so this is just a general rant, okay, to all the candidates if they'll listen. I've listened to all the debates, and I've listened to all the candidates talk about everything they want to do, and I believe in the free enterprise system. I'm not so sure I think our government should be running everything because they don't always do a very efficient or good job. But we have to believe in our country and in our government. But keeping enterprise alive, I've just been wondering, and of course I've asked this to the YouTube debate question, and I had to keep it under whatever, 30, 40 seconds, but what can we do as a people to not let loopholes happen with the insurance companies? You know, like if you've got cancer and it's a pre-existing condition, well, nobody else will take you on. So what can we do to make sure that that doesn't even exist? No insurance company should be able to turn someone down because they already have cancer or something bad, heart condition, diabetes, I don't know, whatever it is diseases. I mean, I think we need to pay something, so we pay as we can with our capability. I mean, I know about not having insurance and being sick, um, having insurance with it and have, not having it, and it smarts. Um, and we have all these people, we just throw them to the curb, you know, let them rot, we don't care. And that's what we're saying when we don't cover them. That's what we're saying when we turn down a condition. No child, no person should be turned down because they can't be insured because they need medicine for cancer or whatever it is. And I know that some of the companies are trying to address this. And I heard all that stuff. But, you know, I guess you've got to combine free enterprise with a little common sense legislation or law not complicated, add-on, tack-on, pork barrel mess. Just some common sense that says can't turn them down because they already have something bad. It just shouldn't be allowed. I mean, these th this is our fiber. Our very society depends on how well we take care of our people because the future depends on it. And I'll save that rant for the next rant that I've got on the future. But... I think that it's kind of a travesty that people are turned down right and left and can't get reinsured if they have something really horrible. When we need it the most, we should be allowed to, to make some type of provision. It seems almost inhumane, and our very humanity gets questioned daily anyway. And, you know, we have a good system, a good country, but we have a lot of things that need fixed, and this, I believe, is seriously one of them. I hope we get this right. That just chaps my britches. And I think it's chapping a whole lot of other people's britches, too, because it seems to be in the news all the time. That's all I got to say.